Hello, welcome to the Freak Show. Bumpy McSquigums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as I continue with my Let's Play of XCOM Long War. This is 139, episode 139. We're getting up there, folks. We're getting up there. I have no idea when this is going to end. <laughs> Make it stop. Make it stop. I don't know. It's fine. Whatever. Thanks to the aliens, our engineering team has managed to negate billions of dollars in traditional aerospace development with a single ship. Sweet. Cool. All right, so that happened. We've um, done some big things here. But I have to admit, my team and I are most proud of the work we put into the Firestorm. I'd be most proud with a, like a nuclear device you could launch into space and destroy all the aliens without damaging our atmosphere or the Earth or any of the solar system, for that matter. But I don't think I we're going to get that. Your efforts to yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Team commander. So nobody cares. I've already put the new Mission control. The interrogation is still underway. Oh, boy. No, it's a high one. It might blow up our, our satellite. Yeah, we have a little bit of a plethora of meld right now. I'll dispatch it. Yay for satellites not getting destroyed. Whoa. A lot of folks just returned. Okay. A lot of... Oh my gosh, look at all of them. Oh no. Is this going to be another base assault? It's starting to look like it. Alright, well, if that is indeed what's going to happen, then we need to prepare for this. Okay. I gotta say, I'm not a big fan of how this is going to play. Oh, wow, we have no... Oh, man, this is gonna be an interesting group. Alright, so... That being said, let's load you out properly, good sir. And it doesn't look like that's even going to be possible at this point. Hold on. Alright, give me a minute, folks. Give me a moment. I'm just gonna unload everybody. Gonna give them just random stuff that nobody cares about. It's fine. Um, okay, okay. If that's another base assault, which you know I enjoy so very much, like it's literally my favorite thing ever, not, then, um, yeah, I'd rather be prepared to not be murdered by it and die a horrible death, if at all possible. So, that's gonna be the plan, the hope, the goal, the dream. As I'm sure you can imagine. But for now, we're going to have to probably unload almost everyone at this point. Because we need the equipment to be available to our people. If, again, at all possible. It could just be another one of those stupid terror ships. They seem to be throwing those at me left, right, center, up, down, and backward. And if it is just a terror ship, that's going to be fine. But if not, well, again, I would like to be prepared. So... That's what we're going to roll with. I don't think the med kits have a limited use. Like, we don't have a limited number of med kits, do we? Maybe we do. Nope, no we don't. Okay. So I don't need to unload them. Carapace, the rocket launcher, that's all fine. It's fine. we got to get rid of that. I don't know. Marksman's rifle. I don't care. Get stuff handled! This will make uh, outfitting folks later super fun. And, eh, there we go. Is that just about everyone? Nope, not quite. We're almost there. Almost done. Bone Dead Mozart might be the last one. We'll see here. I believe that is the case. So we go through all the wounded people. There shouldn't be that many. Okay, there isn't that many. Okay, you're already set. I just want to make sure we got everything that we could. She's the first of the MECs, is she? Or no? She is, but I don't think she's going to be pulled into the combat, so meh. Alright, folks. Well, this could go very, very, very poorly. I don't know exactly what we're rolling with here, but... Whatever it is, is going to be interesting, to say the very, very least. Okay, so we're going to get Murphy's Law outfitted with some sort of non-terrible equipment. 
So let's load him out with uh, the Aegis Armor, Scatter Blaster. I'm fine with all these things thus far. Yeah, I think we'll, we're fine with that. We'll roll with that. Next up, we have him. He is already set. I'm tempted to... You know what? I'm going to. I'm going to give him the Aegis Armor as well. Ekum, he's going to get Carapace Armor. He's going to get the Pulse Sniper Rifle. If we can find it. Come on. Okay, apparently somebody still has that, and I have somehow missed it. Ooh, aha. I say, who has it? And it's you. You have it. Shame on me for missing it. I'm sure you guys are like, what are you doing, Bumpy? We saw the thing, and you just left it. It's because I'm bad at seeing things, guys. I generally skip over stuff a little bit too quickly, and bad Juju Magumbo happens. So, that being said, meh. Okay, alright. Ekum, let's get you outfitted, my friend. Pulse sniper rifle, laser pistol. You know it, we love it. Let's see if we can't get everything that we need. And I could be totally wasting time right now, guys. I have no idea. I'm uh, hoping that I'm not, but it very, very easily could be me wasting time right now. And Lady Hanariel. I think I'll go with one of these. I'm not super keen on the idea, but I think one person having it and one person not having it, probably the best bet. I would prefer the extra shotguns, but eh, just on the off chance that we don't get the opportunity. Well, then I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna split hairs, as they say. All right, I think we get a total of what six people that can come through. So let's see if we actually have six folks outfitted. I believe we do. One, two, three, four, five, and six. We'll do Awesome Sauce 2 just on the off chance that he's able to join the squad. I highly doubt it, but maybe. Maybe it's a possibility. All right, let's give him a scope, and I don't know. A laser sight to increase his aim even more. All right, folks, let's hope it's not that, but if it is, well, so be it. We are ready, as ready as we're going to be. Commander, nope. Our failure to respond to the latest UFO contact it is a sure terror site. One of our top priorities is to maintain satellite coverage huh. over the council's member nations. Okay. Well, that was a big waste of time, guys. I guess you're just going to have to put up with it. But that's how I prepare for a possible base assault, by the way. Now you know. Now you know. All right. So who are we going to send for this? I'm not going to send both of you. Um... You can lead us. Is Murphy law Murphy's law leader? I don't think so. So you are the leader. Alright, so we're going to have HP lead us. Raven's going to go. Crash might go. Murphy's law might go too. Come on, you're not going to go. You're probably not going to go. Face tank, you can't go on top of everything, actually. Yeah, why don't we send face tank instead? Alright, so face tank's gonna go instead. Uh, not gonna send you. So basically, we need an assault, a secondary gunner, a medic, and then other things. Alright, so let's see if we can get the secondary gunner. Come on, scroll, there we go. Good, good. Alright, Gundy Chow, let's see if you can catch up on the kills that you are behind. All right, um, sniper, blah 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 blah, medic. Lady JC is available. Eric Castro is not. Pastel de Congo can go. I'd like to bring some more of my heavy hitters if possible. All right, an assault, and then somebody else. Let's see here, an assault. Looks like Mark Specter's gonna go. Corporal, maybe we can get him into Sergeant Land, and then. Let's see who we have from the low end of the totem pole. We have quite a few people down here. Um, we have the Jewish hammer we haven't been able to use too often yet. Actually, I don't think he's been on a single mission. We'll have to rectify that eventually. His aim's pretty bad for being a sniper too. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Um, Commander Doc Anthony is getting chopped up. Daryl Andrews can't seem to get past Lance Corporal Hood. Let's see if we can't get another sergeant, or, uh, yeah, another sergeant upgraded. So we'll go with, uh, Dominic Godlutsky. There we go. 
So he'll be a corporal and then hopefully upgrade to a sergeant. That's what I was trying to get out, guys. That is what I was trying to get out. All right, so now we get to change the loadout on everyone once again. You should be super excited. Didn't I just make stuff available to people? Why does it seem like this isn't working? All right, where did I put all the stuff? Mm. Am I gonna have to go back in and... Huh, how's this going to work? I think I might have to go back in and just remove all the people's armor that I just threw in there. So that being said, we're going to go back to the front line here. And yes, yes, you're not there and unfortunately your stuff is not counting. So I apologize folks, it's just, it is what it is. Um, I'm just going to give him a bunch of just crap right now. And he's fine. Uh, HP, you're fine, though I'd rather you have this than that. And I'd rather you have that. Excellent. Okay, Lady Hanariel, you are not going on this mission, so you can just take a knee, I guess. So apparently if you forcefully outfit people, they are going to be stuck with those things, despite saying make items available. Captain Surprise Lake Kirk, I don't believe you're coming on this mission, therefore, again, take a knee. Multiple battle scanners, go! Um, again, no thank you. It's totally fine. AJC's not coming. Logan Raven McVeigh is going to be our sniper. So we'll throw, actually I'm going to throw the can I throw the Aegis armor on you? We have an assault and we have a scout. I think I'm still going to throw the Carapace armor on you. That's fine. Alright, let's get you the correct stuff. So this whole first half of this episode, guys, all going to be me messing around with uh, stupid uh, equipment things. Because I'm bad at, at uh, video gaming, apparently, here. Or predicting what the aliens are going to do. I bet they're like, ha ha ha, Bumpy had to waste time doing that. The fool! It's totally fine. I'm okay with it. I'm not super happy, but I'm okay with it. Wait a minute. No. There we go. Now we're talking. Nope. Uh, Sir Hens Mayhor's not coming. No. 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 Maybe. Yes, you are coming. Okay. So you're going to get the Phalanx armor, and we're going to give you... I guess the Gauss rifle. It's totally fine. And of course, you being a medic, you probably should have a few med kits. I'm just thinking out loud here, guys. Just thinking out loud. And apparently, so are the birds. Sorry, guys. Loud birds will be loud. All right, Gundy Chow is our other individual on this mission. Give you a weapon of sorts and all the other goodies to go with it. Double down on Datrin. Not coming, not coming, not coming. No, no, no. You are coming. We'll give you that. We'll give you the pulse. Maybe. There we go. The pulse rifle. And the scope. And there you go. That's totally good. Totally fine. Who else we got? Who else? Oops. I think that might be it. I think that's it. I did somehow skip my uh, Rocketeer class individual, but that's okay. Alright, so we're back up here. And you are already set now, officially. Battle scanner, all that wonderful fun stuff, I like it. Good job, do work, good sir. Brett Yeti Wood, you are not coming. America's not coming, HP is set. Lady Hanariel, not going. Not going. We're just going to look for on mission right now. Make sure everybody is set on mission. On mission. Um. Aha. Pastel de Muerto. Okay, you're on mission. On mission. Oh, it was Dominic Gadluski, wasn't it? That was the one I don't think I... Oh, maybe I did. Yeah, I upgraded you. Well, then who the heck did I miss? Did I not miss anyone? 
All right, let's go take a look. It looks like everybody is outfitted. Aha! Mark Spectre, you're the one I didn't get. I knew I had to have missed somebody. I had to have missed somebody, and I did. All right, so there we go. Now we know what's up. Now we know what's going on. We know that Bumpy is bad, but Bumpy is also able to figure out who he missed. All right. So, yes, 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 yes. Yes, and yes, and launch. That only took 15 minutes, guys. Sheesh. I want you guys to be aware that tomorrow there will be no XCOM. I know. So this episode might actually go long. I don't know. But there will be no XCOM We're tomorrow. We're just inside the Egyptian border. Tomorrow is going to be Sources Focus Friday. The aliens are attacking civilian targets in a densely populated area. The sooner we can eliminate the hostile threat, the more lives... If you haven't heard of, it, heard of it yet, Focus Friday is where I'm going to focus on trying to clear my schedule. And I'm going to bang out as many episodes in a day as I can on one particular game. So Dying Light is tomorrow. Oh, it is a terror mission. Ugh, I hate terror missions. Okay. Oh, somebody on the, just a couple somebody's on the roofs. The roofy roofs. All right. Well, Murphy's Law has got quite the reach, so let's get him moving around doing some stuff. You are clear. We have saved your life because we're heroes and we do these things. You're clear as well. That's two civilians saved already. I feel like a superhero. I probably smell like one too. Wait, what? Let's hope there's no aliens around the corner. <laughs> there are not. Excellent. Um... I generally like, when I'm on this map, when I'm not saving civilians, I like to breach from one area in general. I don't like to... I don't like to breach from multiple spots, but... Mm, I don't know. Not really much we can do. I think I'm going to scoot up here. And we're going to leave it at that. Roger, Dodger. Going to probably do some hit and run tactics because we have a few people who can probably actually do that. Going to stand here, going to steady the weapon. Face tank, I think, can still save people. S despite having all our limbs chopped off, I think she still has thumbs. I think we've established that. Heading to that location. Oh boy. I hate moving out, guys. I hate moving out. It makes me paranoid. It makes me panicked a little bit. I'm like... <laughs> it's not good. It's not good. Alright, we'll hunker our sail zone down. Dominic Godlutsky. Is there a way onto the roof from here? It does not appear like there is. Okay, gonna move right there with Dominic. And, okay. Nothing horrible has happened yet, but it's about to... Oh, okay, because we didn't have enough problems. We needed to aggro another group of people to come join the fun. They got me flanked. Okay, so there's a lot of bad stuff happening right now. And we're going to have to figure out how exactly we're going to do it. To where we don't end up dying a horrible, awful, just nasty, nasty death. I'm not entirely certain. It's a lot of movement. We have saved three people thus far, and that is a good thing. However, we also have a lot of little issues that we're going to have to work out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep your screaming down to a dull roar, will you? No. No, 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 no. Stop it. I thought I had you selected. Awkward. All right. So, I said good day, sir. And it didn't crit. Hopefully you're not intimidated by the giant thing. You are fantastic. Good, good. Very, very happy for me that you did that. That's awesome. Okay, up next. What do we have available? We actually can land that shot. That's mildly impressive. Take it, Gundy Chow. And by land that shot, I mean totally miss because you're terrible at life. That's totally fine. Just saying. Try to hit what you're aiming at, man. Just try to hit what you're aiming at. Hi, do you not see the gigantic thing right next to you? Maybe shoot that. I don't know. That does seem to be of more pressing concern. That did no damage at all. 
Well done on the panic resist, though. I'll give you that, my friend. Why? No, I didn't cycle through. I figured it wouldn't... S uh, okay, now I'm terrible at life, guys. I'm the one that's terrible at life at this point. Alright, in other news, Hungry Punker, terrible, terrible positioning. And I don't think we can stay where we're at. Well, this sucks so bad. Um, uh, all right. Well, we'll figure something out here in a minute. I'm gonna move here. I'm going to use our medic to hopefully pull. Why am I ever surprised at how things go? I'm like, seriously, why? Why am I ever even a little bit surprised with how things actually transpire? Like, there should be no surprise. Like, this stuff should be like, yep, that's about right. Moving out. Gonna move here, maybe triggering Overwatch? Nope, no Overwatch triggering. Going to shoot him in the face. He's going to be unhappy. It did almost no damage once again, by the way. I want to point that out. Are you kidding me? Moving out. How did you miss that shot? Like, seriously, what? Well, at least somebody with close combat specialist managed to land the shot. Dear lord. Alright, well, we're gonna move over here with Murphy's Law, triggering lightning reflexes. I'm blowing a hole in the wall, too, which is also unfortunate and unpleasant. We're going to murder your face, say good day. Tell you what, boys and girls, things are not looking super nice. All right, 57% looks like our best possible shot. We're gonna take it, maybe we're lucky we hit. We did, but we didn't actually kill anything. Hungry Punker could probably wreck a fool or two, but if he does, he's going to die a horrible death. Like, he could kill that, like 100% could kill that, and maybe... I'm going for it. I don't give a crap. Do it. Oh, the critical isn't enough. Hmm. I was thinking if we if we did manage to drop that guy, we could probably kill this. Well, I'm gonna play bold. I'm gonna play crazy. I don't know. I'm a little little perturbed right now with how things are actually going. We'll see. This was probably a really really bad idea. I'm actually full of them, so. It's not surprising, by the way. Okay, we're gonna run over here and really, really upset the locals. And we're gonna say good day to you. And we're gonna see what's next. Bring it on. I'm ready for some chaos and some craziness. Let's go. Bye, little individual dude. Little civilian, little skibby doing a skivic duty. Yeah, I said duty, what? Alright, so we've lost two people. We saved three so far, though, so we're still ahead of the curve. But what's next? Only time. Well, uh oh, that's not good. Alright, remember when I said you have to be like a Muhammad Ali and you have to float like a butterfly, sting like a bee? This is it. This is the time, man. Butterfly, bee, sting, do it. Make it happen. Okay, you can be suppressed. I can deal with this guy as long as my sniper's not freaked out still. This is worse. Eh, whatever. You can be you can be hospitalized. I can repair you. I can fix you. But you know what? No one died yet. Positive enemy contact. That's not good. That's a little bit worse. That that might be a problem. I still think we're okay. And this guy still has to move, doesn't he? No. Oh, you can't still be panicked. No, 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 no. This is unacceptable. Oh my gosh, you guys are such a bunch of babies. Please kill him. I'm about to start keeping score. I'm about to start hoping I don't die. Okay. So that happened. Um, uh, might be able to kill the squid. Cool. Gun to chow. Finally doing some work. Took a while, but he's finally doing something. It's good. Uh huh. What kind of distance are we looking at here? 
Well, there's absolutely no way he can stay there and not die a horrible death. I mean, that's a given, right? Let's do this. So we're going to run away because we're scared and almost dead. But he did work. He did his job and he did it well, and I cannot fault him for that. I mean, I could, but it wouldn't be fair. There now. Pretty sure I'm outside the range of the enemy being here. So, oh, really, this is these are my shot options, huh? Yeah, whatever. I figured I'd take a shot. Might as well. Looks like our medic can come up. Con Congo Pastel de Muerto is able to patch you right up. It's probably going to take two to heal you all the way up, buddy. And I will do it. You have earned yourself the right. It would have been nice had I not missed the second shot with Dominic Godlewski because I'm terrible at clicking things. I assume with the threat being more immediate, it would switch targeting, but it didn't. And it's my own fault. I should have known better. But I chose not to know better. And we totally missed that shot. Awesome. However, we get to repair! And by repair, I mean reload! Alright. I think he's probably going to go cry and lick his wounds in the corner. Hopefully... <sighs> so hopefully people stop dying, but that doesn't seem to be the case. I'm hoping these guys all come out after us, but I have a feeling they're going to go back in and kill other things. Maybe not, though. Maybe they missed this one over here in the corner. I would like them all to charge us down. Come on. And I swear, Liara and, and Raven, you guys better be back up and not panicked anymore. Come on. Come on out. That's a good giant ugly robot bug thing, or alien bug thing. Well, that sucks. That one's going to go off and do something terrible that I can't really... Yeah, now we have a zombie. Fantastic. They need to all come at me right away and not do this. This is what I don't like. This is terrible. They need to all come up. I need to be able to light all of them on fire and then laugh when they die a horrible death. Now that they're doing all this, they're going to go and hunt all the humans and I'm going to have to find them. And then it's going to be terrible for me. And yeah, this is this is just really bad. This is almost curse worthy how bad this is going now. Like it was bad, then it was okay, then it was really bad, and now it's I don't I don't even know what it is anymore. Well, I don't think I need to be under him getting drooled on, but I'm going to move over a little bit and fire. He's going to have a bad day with that, and... Hey, you're back! Yay, that's so useful to me now that you're here and stuff. What? How do I not have line of sight at that one? Uh, whatever, take that shot. Kill him off. Okay, next up, we have Hungry Punker for the win. Or the miss, why not? Why am I surprised? Why am I surprised anymore? Also, how do you not have a... Like, he's hanging over the wall over there, right? He's larger than the pillar. How do you not see him and not be able to shoot? Like, how is that a thing? It's fine. It's dead, but still. Seriously? Like, for realsies? And we're gonna have to go and expose Liara to, like possible near-death experiences now because of her current very very slow situation with dealing things that's not great we're gonna get Gundy Chow to move up hopefully she's able to actually hit anything that comes her way it's it's doubtful at times it is doubtful oh there's gonna be zombies oh I don't like zombies I don't like zombies at all it's okay it's totally fine guys it's totally fine all right, alien bug, are you going to come play with us now, or are you going to go off and kill more people I don't know exists? I hear gunfire. That doesn't bode well for me. And I hear a lot of screaming in the background, and... Ah, there's a bug. Sap. Ooh, we hit him, too. Impressive. Go, Dominic. See, I messed up. You didn't mess up. Our other people all messed up. Oh, who do we have here? Oh, if you would have hit that buddy, you would have been my superhero. What is he doing? Well. 
I gotta say, they're not really... doing anything impressive right now. Okay, that's three of the four that are missing. There's a zombie, and we're missing the one that was actually out back there. I should be able to deal with the zombie as long as it doesn't block my way, and I think it just did. Oh, good. Wonderful, there's gonna be zombies on the roof now. Because that's not completely ridiculous in any way. Okay, and we'll come back to you in a moment. Well, it looks like possibly... I've got loose he can land both of these shots, and maybe with a little bit more pepper on the second one. He might actually be able to kill him off. Let's go with it, buddy. You got this. Yeah, there's my boy. I don't know what that means, but well done. Well done. All right, Z all right, uh, Murphy's Law. Get there, get eyes on the Zambi. I think Gundy Chow can actually do some Zambi work. I don't think there's enough to kill. Oh my gosh, why do you miss so many shots? You're so bad at aiming. Like if aiming was a currency, you would be broke right now. Like even the medic shoots better than you do. How is that a thing? Confirmed. This is not great. Oh, and you're out of bullets too. Fantastic. It's killing time. Okay, and you have no shot. Of course you don't. Why would I expect any less? All right. Well, we'll see what we can do. It's going to be all up to Liara to somehow position herself into. I actually think she's fine. For a minute there, I thought no, but the guy up top is down. Which means that this, in theory, are you kidding me with this? Oh! Wait, what do you mean friendly fire? Who am I friendly firing? What? What? Okay, care to explain which friendly I'm- oh! Oh, okay. I see him now. There's a person kneeling down behind. I'm sorry, lady. You're, uh... Hold on, we're gonna cancel that. I wanna make sure I get all of them. Your life doesn't mean much. This is, uh... The good of the few is outweighed by the good of the many. Sorry. Also, that wasn't enough to kill it, but it is panicked. That means there should only be one on the roof who's murdering people, and there should be zombies coming up on the roof as well. And, of course, that. Which is super fun. And, of course, our other Muton that we didn't kill either. Whatever. One of my more sloppy missions, guys. One of my more sloppy missions. But it is simply what it is. Eh. It happens. It happens. Okay. And the zombie fell off the roof. As is to be expected. And come over and vomit on our people eventually. Not, not right away. Close combat specialist says you're not going to do anything, actually. See ya! Oh, didn't crit. That's kind of surprising. Whatever, you can stand there and stink next to our people. Oh, yay, more dead people. And regenerating health. Well, not the end of the world, I suppose. Who do we have a line of sight on? Well, we kind of don't, but we kind of do at the same time. I'm going to move over here. And that sucked. Okay. Well, what I think I'm going to do is throw this in to the mix and, and see what we can see, shall we? Absolutely nothing. That was awesome. Good. I'm so glad I threw the scanner now. That makes me happy. Not at all. Not even a little. Affirmativo. All right. We'll come over here and reload. HP, you can shoot the zombie. Well done, sir. Yeah, didn't do much there, did you, buddy? Okay, looks like we can move and then possibly reload if need be. Mark Spectre is here. Probably has a shot on 61%. It's not too bad, actually. Oh, I missed the blue hole in the roof. Somehow, Raven Logan McVeigh still has absolutely no shot on anyone because she's awesome. That's super cool. We're going to be able to reload at least. Still, literally no shot. 
Moving to come over here. Hopefully not aggroing the thing outside. We did not. Excellent. This should be a relatively easy kill. 94%. Face tank says good. Oh my god. Face tank says nothing and now we've aggroed stuff and now we have more issues. Yay for problems. Oh and one of those because we don't have enough problems already. Okay so things are going from worse to worse to worse to worse. I'm not sure when it's going to get better exactly, but it doesn't look like it's going to be anytime right. soon. This is going to be one of my more irritated uh, missions, guys. It's like everything that could possibly go wrong has gone wrong, and then ten more things went wrong on top of that. So Murphy's Law definitely showing up in force right now. <sighs> oh, man. Maybe he'll move forward. Yeah, I didn't think so. Oh my god, that hit it for 11? Are you kidding me right now? Okay. Well, I think our country is not going to be super happy with us, but that's okay. You know why this is okay? Because they are already super happy with both of us. So, it might be okay after all. Alright, what in the heck am I going to do? We're going to trigger Overwatch. I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope, I hope we did not. Of course we didn't. Why would we trigger Overwatch? That would be too easy. Alright, let's just shoot you in the face. Good, we actually hit. Very impressive. Um, you should have the shot on the giant thing. And you do. It won't be enough to kill. But, if you don't miss, like you've missed every single shot, yay! That's going to put us in an okay position. And I think, with a little bit of luck, and some praying, we can smack open the door and do two damage to it. With a pulse rifle. Oh my god. And that was with an executioner. <laughs> Why? Why is this a thing? Oh, it's so good, guys. Whatever. It's been handled. Jeez. Just absolutely asinine. Alright. Next up. Face tank can move there and can breathe fire. We're gonna try it. I'm 100% sure I didn't miss move here. Good. Good. So now you're panicked. I don't have to worry about the massive damage that you can somehow pull out of your anus. Gosh, anus poolers, I tell you. I tell you, them anus poolers, they are the worst of the worst of the worst. Alright, I am going to gas our group of fellows here. And hope that they are going to be okay ish. Hungry Punker still can't do anything yet, but he's getting closer to being able to do something. And eventually I will reload here and have bullets. I'm not sure about Mark Spector yet. Still Raven Logan McVeigh, totally useless to us. Um, I don't even know where I can move her or where she wouldn't be any less useless. I guess there. I mean, maybe she's far enough away that they're not going to, like, snipe her from 100 miles. How does she still see no one? How is this a thing? Like, I want, I want to see through her eyes. Like, she should see all of this. All of this should be visible to her. Uh... All right. Well, we're gonna play a little bit risky. I know, shocking, isn't it? Oh, we can't do it. He actually doesn't have anywhere near the movement I thought he did. I figured he could like hop the counter, but no, apparently not. We'll play a little bit less risky with him. How's that? Um, we're gonna go here and see if we can't kill one of the little floaty things. 99%. What do we have? 27. 99%. We'll take it. There we go. And that should be it for us. Whew. Super messy mission, guys. Super messy mission with super be Why? How did that not trigger? Watch the sides. 
Hi, you know you have this skill? It's it's a really cool skill. It's called Kill anything and everything that comes close to you or close combat specialist for those of you scoring at home Yet you didn't do that at all. In fact, not even a little bit Okay, we have a floater who landed another floater who landed I really wish we had a third fire right now because I could just melt all three of them and it would be sweet sweet nice But we do not have that so we have other things that we have to deal with, like you. Goodbye. In the zone, we're gonna kill another one. We're gonna go in the zone once again. Yes, we are. And we have another shot. No, it's not very good. Ah, why not? Might as well take it. Ethereal deflection didn't really do much for us. Unfortunately, uh, what do we have? 20, 35, 45, okay. Really? You're just gonna reflect every att- uh oh, I broke the game. Okay, folks, I'm back from the crash, and I am going to do something totally different now. Why? Because the game cheats, it hates my soul, and it can go... eat dirt or something. Cuss word, cuss word, cuss word. Okay, so, what am I talking about? 20 tries now. 20, 20, 20 tries to replicate my double kill and then miss, right? Not a single time I've been able to kill either one of these. 20 times in a row, not been able to. 10 of those times I decided, you know what, that's fine, we're gonna move on from there, I don't care. I'm not gonna get stuck up on it, it's fine. Medics, the next person to shoot, 93% shot at this guy. 10 times in a row, 93% missed. This game can eat my big toe, because I am sick of this crap, but whatever. We're gonna ignore it and move on. It's really the only thing we can do, so let's do it. 85%, are we gonna miss this too? Nope. Okay, and a reload. Let's see, Murphy's Law, not gonna do anything with you yet. Face Tank could do stuff, but has no bullets. So what am I gonna do with Face Tank? I'm gonna walk out here in a horrible, horrible place. Why is there this big area of effect around this thing? It's kind of confusing and weird. Gonna punch it really, really hard. See what happens. Ugh. Did almost no damage. I am so unhappy with that horrible, horrible skill. The kinetic strike module, garbage. Whoever said it was good is a liar. It is absolute, just trash tier garbage. It has barely ever done anything good. Oh my gosh, you hit the 49%, though you missed the 80s and 70s. Why does that surprise me? <laughs> All right, well, what is our shot on the wonderful thing over... Th get out of my way. Oh, well, you know what? I can kill you now. No, I can't. No, it's the other one. Oh, oh, okay, now. Now I finally crit it. Oh, my God. Whatever. Fine. I'll take it. Apparently, it was the 21st attempt that I needed to make. Whatever. In the zone, will we actually get it? Oh, my gosh, we did. That is a miracle. Is she going to get, like, blown up? I don't remember if those things explode or just fade. I guess they just fade. We're in the zone, we're able to reload again. And are we actually able to shoot? One more time. That's kind of funny, I think we actually are. Wow. 31%? Why not? Let's just go for it. So this worked out way better than it had any right to. I guess after my 20 uh, failed attempts, we finally got something working our way. Are you going to actually land your attack button? Oh my gosh, everybody's hitting stuff! What has happened? This is an XCOM. This is some weird fantasy XCOM that doesn't exist in reality. I mean, I'll take it. I'll definitely take it, but what the heck? Alright, we have Mark Spectre, who's really got no good place to move and no bullets, so we're definitely going to have to at least alleviate the bullet issue. We have our sniper who still can't seem to shoot anyone. Oh my gosh, she can see people now. Holy crap. All right, well, things are looking up now after that horrible, horrible series of reloads, and you're leaving for some unknown reason. Gonna kill the last person. Did we kill all the little skittering bug guys? I thought there was still one left on the roof up here, but I don't know where it's at. Yeah, get dodged. Okay, so now I'm far less angry about how everything is actually panning out. Our sniper is going to shoot somebody and probably kill them. Hopefully, kill them in one shot. Get him! Yeah! 
I like that. That was good. That was sweet, sweet, nice. All right, gonna come on over here. Gonna reload. Well, this was a terrible mission for me, guys. I'm just saying, this is one of my worst missions ever. But it turned out okay. It actually turned out okay. Who knew? Who knew this would actually turn out so well? I say that now. Watch. Some sort of weird malarkey is gonna happen where. I'm just gonna get wrecked and killed immediately, and then I'm gonna be like, no. I still feel like we're missing one or two people, not not our people, but like enemies. Yeah, 14 of the survivors died. We started strong, we didn't finish strong. That much is certain. We most assuredly did not finish strong. Heading to that location. I'm gonna go over here and Overwatch. Prepare some more health. There shouldn't be anybody really left for them to shoot, so they should be coming after us now. Aha! There's the other bug. And it should come in. Hey, we just shot somebody who looks a lot like our medic. That's kind of weird. Or a poster of somebody who looks a lot like our medic. Oh my gosh, Hungry Punker! Finally got to shoot somebody! Hey, overall, it's well played. Sorry, guys, I'm still coughing. Quite a lot, in fact. Ow, that actually hurt. My brain is, like, injured off of that cough. Holy crap. Is there no way to get up on the roof? Like, there's a second floor, right? But the second floor doesn't lead anywhere? Huh, that could be a problem. We know how well I deal with aliens on a roof. And not, not all that great. Not all that great is the is the correct response or answer. All right, Target confirmed. getting over there. Trigger the Overwatch. Oh man, sorry guys, my throat is just ugh. it doesn't hurt at all anymore, but it just again it just keeps tickling and coughing and it's just uh, it's just, it's so annoying. It's like the most annoying thing ever. And I'm actually coughing so hard now that it's actually hurting my head. Like, the right side of my brain felt like it was going to explode. I guess it's such a blood pressure spike when I cough that it's real, real bad for me. Oh well, it is what it is. Alright, so we're going to close on, close in or close up or close around this individual that is hiding from us. And we are going to hope that we're able to murder his soul or something along those lines. Alright. We can get our sniper over there. Assuming our sniper doesn't get shot and murdered, I'll be pretty happy. But the potential for that to happen is still there. What kind of shot do you have? 49%? Not super impressive, but you know what? I've seen worse. And we're going to get a little bit closer and let you shoot from a slightly closer position. And it didn't actually change your percentage at all. You totally missed, but boy, oh boy, did you make a nice little shiny beam of light go up into the sky. And I can appreciate that. I really can. Alright, we'll get Gundy Chow to go out here. Probably gonna go out wide with our sniper over here and then try to kill him from that angle. Not sure it'll work, but that's the plan. Okay. So, little known fact. Ethereals really, really mean when it comes to... Oh, hi. Almost forgot about you. And by almost, I mean I forgot about you. I thought we had killed him. He, like, showed himself and we murdered his face already. Apparently not. Okay, lightning reflexes. Are we going to get the super duper unluck of... No, nope. No, we're not. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, we're going to come here and... Maybe hit you? Oh my gosh, we actually landed a shot. Who knew? In other news, I'm going to come over here and I'm going to shoot you with Cango de Muerto right in the backside and probably miss the 94%. Nope. We landed it. Are you going to be paranoid, panicked, or freaked out in any way? No. Nope. Good Gundy Chow. Now is your time to make up for your horrible, horrible, awful aim. And you have done so! And you are victorious in, well, this one thing. Alright, Dominic Godlutsky, not quite in a good spot. Not yet, anyway. Uh, face tank should be able to still get... Oh, how is this a thing? I don't know, but I like it, I think. Alright, we'll, we'll reload, I guess.
You know what? Let's give you some running and gunning. Let's see, maybe you can get the kill. Move, 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 move! Go, buddy, go! You've done so much work this time. You've literally made this a successful mission where it shouldn't have been a successful mission. You deserve this kill. If you can take it, it's yours, buddy. Well done. Yeah, that didn't go super well. So, that was one of the more messy missions you'll see from me. But hey, you know what? In the end, we were victorious. Thankfully, it's in Africa, where Africa loves us, so it's not that big of an issue. You got wounded for 28 days, but you earned no upgrades somehow. Did they just, like, stop giving... Oh, okay. Like, did they just stop giving upgrades out to people who do, like, amazing work? Because he's actually gotten 15 kills now. I don't know. Gundy Chow, you actually are over the one-for-one -one kill threshold, so you are climbing the ranks. After your really, really poor showing at the beginning of that, it's nice to see that you're a little bit better off now. It's also nice to see you are a tech sergeant with double tap, so you are now twice as useful as you were before, assuming you land any of your shots. That's always going to be the thing. 82 is not bad. I mean, I don't know if it went up, but it's not bad. And Dominic Godlewski, you are now a sergeant. Or a sergeant. Um, we're going to go with the aggression. We are all about aggression here, folks. And with that chaotic, horrible, horrible mess. Eh. It is what it is. Let's go take a look at the situation room. Africa, with all of the horrible spike there, with almost everybody dying. It's barely a blip on the radar. It's not that big of an issue. Anyhow, guys and girls and ladies and gentlemen, that is going to do it for today and tomorrow's XCOM. Because, well, tomorrow is all about dying light and finishing that up. I have no idea how long I've gone. I think we're around the 40-something minute mark, maybe 50 minutes. Stop talking, man. Stop talking. You're, you're interrupting me. Let's go take a look at the officer training school. Regimental officers and commanding officers are still available. And what about officer promotions? We have one across the board that we can do. That's not bad. I'll think about upgrading some of our folks. I'm going to do mission control to see what's coming. That's about it. An abduction site. Alright folks, well, in the next mission, or the next episode, we are going to go and deal with an abduction site. Until then, I want to thank you all for stopping by the Freak Show. I realized today was a little bit more of a grumpy bumpy for XCOM. I don't know, playing all the really, really, really high-end, like, really good games that I love, 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 turn-based strategy games. And then coming back to XCOM, it's kind of like, eh. I don't know. XCOM, it's been running for so long, and there's still so many things that I don't like about the game. Versus, like, say, Xenonauts. There's a lot of things I liked about Xenonauts that, well, XCOM does, in my opinion, wrong. But again, that's my opinion. It's still a good game, guys. Like, honestly, if it was like a 50-50 game for me, I'd be like, meh. And I probably would just stop at this point. But I'll see it through to the end. Uh, Long War definitely makes it harder. If you guys are not playing on PC, you need to go pick it up and get Long War and play it. And then see how you do, because this is a lot more challenging than either of the other two games. Enemy Within or Enemy Unknown. So, it is what it is. Either way, guys, that's going to do it. Tomorrow is Focus Friday. Or Focus Fridays. I don't know if we want to throw an S on there. I don't know how long I'm going to do it, but anytime I get behind, this is going to be the way I'm going to catch up. So, hopefully that's okay, and you guys enjoy the conclusion, maybe, of Dying Light. If not, well, maybe next Friday we'll conclude it. Either way, that's going to do it for this episode, and for XCOM for today, I will see you guys again on Saturday for XCOM. Until then, my name is Bumpy McSquiggums, and I will see you later.